Hi, this is Jay. Welcome to Bright Ideas. The Philippine government's policy to give protection to children is set forth in Section 13, Article 1 of the Philippine Constitution, which provides that the state recognizes the vital role of youth in nation building and shall promote and protect their physical, moral, spiritual, intellectual, and social being. It shall inculcate in the youth patriotism and nationalism and encourage their involvement in public and civic affairs. To give effect to the state's declared policy, legislative enactments will promulgate it. Republic Act 9344, the act establishing a comprehensive juvenile justice and welfare system. This act, signed on May 15, 2006, exempts children 18 years old and below from criminal liability. They will only be subjected to an intervention program offense. Intervention may take the form of an individualized treatment program that could include counseling, skills training, education, and other activities that will enhance the child's well-being. However, children above 15 or below 18 may have to face appropriate proceedings if the prosecution panels proves they acted with discernment in committing an offense. Republic Act No. 7610, known as the Special Protection of Children Against Child Abuse. This act directs the formulation of a comprehensive program for the protection of children against child prostitution and other sexual abuse, child trafficking, obscene publications, and indecent shows in other acts of abuse and circumstances which endanger a child's survival and normal development. This Special Committee for the Protection of Children is headed by the Department of Justice and the Department of Social Welfare, known as DSWD. The Republic Act No. 7658 is an act prohibiting the employment of children below 15 years of age. This act prohibits the hiring of children as workers in whatever establishments and in whatever form. Republic Act No. 8533, known as the Anti-Rape Law of 1997, also known as an act expanding the definition of the crime of rape, reclassifying the same as a crime against persons amending the Purpose Act No. 3815 as amended, otherwise known as the Revised Penal Code and for other purposes. Filipino Children, Child 21 this is a strategic programming network that promotes and safeguards the rights of Filipino children. This serves as a roadmap for the national government and local government, non-government organizations, and the private sector in setting priorities for action and in allocating and utilizing resources to promote the rights of Filipino children. It puts greater emphasis on the needs of especially vulnerable children and puts into sharper focus on the rights of all children to special education.